Many businesses say they're having a tough time hiring workers as they rebound from the pandemic. Some restaurants are now using robots to serve customers. Here's ABC's Megan Tevrezian. This morning, restaurants across the country are struggling to keep up with demand. Business is starting to boom, but hiring is not. In South Florida, where the hospitality industry is rebounding to pre-pandemic levels, hotels and restaurants say there aren't enough people applying for jobs. It was just interesting to see that there was a slow demand of folks wanting to come back into the workspace. The reluctance impacting restaurants nationwide. With Restrictions loosening across the country as a lot of us are getting vaccines and feeling comfortable going out again. Restaurants find themselves faced again with potentially the toughest staffing crunch that they've, they've faced in years. Experts say stimulus checks and unemployment benefits are discouraging people to return to work. Have that were laid off during the pandemic have moved to other industries. Other workers aren't quite comfortable yet going back to the workplace. The hotel industry also struggling. The reality is hotels are labor intensive. Uh, entities and therefore uh, staffing and ramping up for the um, newfound demand has been a challenge. Staffing shortages have forced businesses to get creative. Here we are. This restaurant is using robots, three of them, to fill in the gaps. We've been struggling along. We decided that these three little robots over here would helps out. Robots Peanut, Beavis and Butthead help lead guests to tables and even sing happy birthday to them. Happy birthday to Another issue contributing to the staffing shortages is the minimum wage. With capacity restrictions, workers are getting fewer tips, so they've shifted to better paying jobs. Kenneth, Mona. Megan, thank you.